Good morning. Saturday morning. Vlog number 20. I have no idea what's going to happen today, but as you can see, my life gets pretty interesting when I'm vlogging, so who the hell knows? Anyway, it's in the 50s here in Florida, which is freaking cold. I still have shorts on, but I may have to go put long pants on to go for the bike ride. Anyway, let's get this weekend kicked off and uh, see what happens. All right, run is done. I wouldn't be recording this, but earlier this week you heard me say I went under 13 seconds uh, for the first time. Well, today I was only 17 seconds from going under 12. So, knocked another 30 seconds off today. I'm getting there, guys. I'll be running a mile before you know it. Um, but every day, just a little further. Uh, a little faster. Anyway, let's get this bicycle ride in. I'm out. All right, workout is done. And there it is, sun's out. It's gonna be a great Saturday. We'll see you in a bit. All right, Saturday, I get to be out in my garage. I need to get this kind of cleaned up. All my tools put up, as I've said before, I hate working in a messy garage. So I'll pick up from this job, roll it out of here and bring the bikes in. Um, I need to put a speaker on mama's bike and uh, I'm having battery issues on the red bike. So I'm gonna do a little diagnostics and I think it's just a bad battery. And I got that battery in Michigan while I was on my trip. So um, it should still be under warranty, uh, but we'll take a look and see. So let's get everything ready to go. All right, Red's battery issue was my fault. When I put it in there, I didn't get the leads, the wires tight. Um, I'm usually like really particular about that. So I'm not sure what I was doing on this particular day. But anyway, I tightened it down. Everything seems to be working fine now. So easy fix. I like those. Now mama's bike. I'll fill you in on a little story, then I will get a replace. So um, last, uh, I think it was June, Mama Badger decided that she wanted a speaker on her bike so she could have music. So I went and got the Kiriakin speaker um, and it works great, except it quit working um, well on the way home from Daytona, I think it was, so in October. So basically July, August, September, October, it, four months and it quit working on us. So I got another one. We're gonna give them a second chance, uh, but I will be honest. Uh, I reached out for the warranty part and nobody replied to me. So I'm just going, I just bought another one. I'm gonna stick the old one in the box and send it back um, because uh, four months is fucking ridiculous. So let's see if this one lasts any longer. But anyway, there's mama's speaker. Her Kiriakin speaker. She really loves the speaker. Um, just doesn't like that it only lasted four months. So anyway, we're going to get it on there. So anytime that you're doing any kind of wiring and you can, you will find it's much easier 
to take a piece of wire and tie it to this when you pull it out. So then you can just pull the new one right back in and I don't have to take this cowl off. Uh, just saves you a couple steps. Not that the cowl is hard to take off, but it's still two, four, five, about eight bolts that you don't have to remove if you run that wire through. So anyway, just a quick tip. Like new speakers on and it works like we'll see how long it lasts all right guys so um it's been a productive day i got mama badger's new speaker on it's working great i got the battery issue fixed on red and it was just my fault i didn't tighten the the cables tight enough so um yay and yay and uh i just got done shooting my third fat boy friday video for the day uh, i'm gonna have at least three fat boy fridays in a row after the first of the year today has been highly productive win win and win so i don't know what i'm gonna do next probably go edit some of these videos what is this noisy shit coming down through here oh look at that Nice hair, dude. <laughs> you just, you never know what you're going to see going down the street. <laughs> but hey, my passion for motorcycles started on something a little like that. So I can definitely uh, relate to kids out having fun on two wheels. Uh, now I'm a little older kid, and I still like to go out and have fun on two wheels. Anyway, guys, I guess I'm going to go edit some of these videos. Done in the garage. Oh, I do need to see if, I need to see if the V-Rod will start. I haven't started it in a while. So I put it on the trickle charger this morning. See if she's going to start. There's Silver just sitting there waiting on me to take it apart and put it back together. Pay a little attention to her. And then here's Speedy. See if Speedy's going to start. I will admit, probably one of the best buys I ever made and lucky finds was that V-Rod. I mean, a 2004 V-Rod with 17,000 miles on it with nothing wrong um, for 1,500 bucks. Uh, and it came with windshield and Harley bags. Hell, those are probably 1,500 bucks themselves. So I really lucked out. Um, Desi has ridden the crap out of it. It's one of my favorite bikes to ride too. It's just a fun bike to ride. But anyway, now into the house to do some editing we'll see you tomorrow <laughs>